Hello and welcome. My name is Dylan and today we're going to be talking about the legendary PsyOps Battlegrounds, where you can find it and all of the different limitations and the extra difficulty added on top. So all you're going to do is open up your map. On your map, you're going to open your director. In your director, you're going to go to the helm. And in the helm, in the top part of the helm, we'll see the regular PsyOps Battlegrounds playlist. And then to the right, we will see the Legend PsyOps Battleground playlist. Now, the recommended power for this activity is 1,550. You can have up to three players, and you can do it with friends. But if we click into the PsyOps Battlegrounds here, so we click Select, and we look on the left-hand side over here, we can see that there's going to be champions. There's going to be Barrier and Unstoppable Champions. Your equipment will be locked, there's going to be match game, and there's going to be shielded foes, which goes along with match game here. Now, on the right-hand side over here, we can see that there are two other slots, and this means that you have to physically invite people or be invited by people to play this game mode. There is no matchmaking. So what you can do is you can simply um, go to the app store on your phone and look for the Destiny 2 Companion app. And using the Destiny 2 Companion app, you can go to, down to the bottom, click on Fire Teams, and you can look for Fire Teams for specific activities. So you're going to click on PsyOps Battlegrounds. And in your title or in other people's titles, if you're just trying to join them, you're just simply going to click on... Um, ones that say Legend PsyOps Battlegrounds. Now, something really important that you can go ahead and use for the match game and the shielded foes, a really, really important new perk that you can go ahead and use if I go ahead to the details on this weapon. The perk is called Adaptive Mutations. This weapon adapts its damage output and effectiveness against enemy shields that don't match the weapon's damage type. So this is the best perk that you can have for match game. And if you combine it with something else here, like breaking a combatant shield with this weapon, uh, fills its magazine from reserves, energy weapons regenerate ammo on hit when matching the damage type to the combatant shields. These two perks, so adaptive mutations and genesis, will make something like match game much more manageable and everybody won't have to run all of the different uh, elemental types. You can just focus on damage weapons for most people and you can have one person run like an AR, for example, with the adaptive mutations and they can just go through and break all of the shields on the different types of enemies. And then your teammates can just come through with their heavy damage weapons, special weapons and whatever, uh, and they can destroy those enemies for easy completions. So anyways, guys, I hope this video helped. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, everybody.